Look at this cutie pie baby. Is anybody else's babies just hate blankets? <laughs> He's kicking it off. We're watching Emperor's New Groove and getting through our to-do list. Naughty, naughty. You're gonna be chilly. dinner tonight. It's the curry that I made yesterday with rice and cucumbers, lettuce, banana peppers, and some sauerkraut with a little lime garlic hummus dressing I made. Kind of mix in a lot of different flavors. I'll let you know how it is. So he's trying to salvage a vlog for the day. <laughs> what time is it? It's like 8? Yeah. How was dinner? It's eight dinner was delicious. It was a really good mixture of like having the curry be with the like more vinegary things it was good that i did an hour and a half it's like 8 40 i think yeah like an hour and 40 minutes worth of dishes mm -hmm. and i've been hanging out with the little baby and folding laundry we're kind of like doing a catch-up night but that doesn't do good for our hearts no. until it's done right. once it's well, done we'll be happy and once we're done i have to start working again i'm really sick of these like long work days followed by work evenings me too um and so is he and Yesterday he was the sleepiest kid in town, and today he is the not sleepiest kid in town. But I think he'll conk out soon. Here is the bulk of the Christmas decorations piled up, cleaned, organized, ready to go. I'm going to pull out the bins tonight, which is crazy because once I pull the bins out, they're staying out. And then the packing truly begins, because we are about to sign our lease right now, I think. I'm going to ask her if she wants to, because we got it digitally sent to us. We can do e-signatures on it, so then it's like for real, for real, for real, for real. Another task that we have to get done is signing our lease. So it's like 90 pages. Got to go in and initial, and sign, and read it. Peter's actually... I'm done. You're done? We both have our own leases, and Peter went went through. Earlier today, I went through and I read all the yeah. 39 pages. That's like always been your job yeah. in our life. I read all 89 pages, um, nothing out of the blue, nothing out of the order I'm too concerned. No. So. It's so funny, we've had so many, this is our fifth apartment, and so many people and properties do things differently, whereas this is probably the most legit lease we've ever signed. Probably, yeah. We've Bella, like our... Bella was good. Yeah, the apartment that we moved to down here in Florida, um, they... It was like more of a portal. It was a huge complex. It was a lot more like just, they were covering their backs as much as they were covering our backs. But we've rented just from individuals before. We had to ask somebody for a lease once. Yeah, we were, they didn't, they didn't want to do a lease. And we we're like, no, like we, we need. Can we at least get something in writing? So, yeah that we all signed so we right. to show up one day and the cops are like kicking us out right and then our first apartment was a sublease it was only 10 months um and then this apartment kind of low-key but like in between there was still yeah. but standard good old lease a lot yeah. of chicago city ordinances right. they have to so with. if you ever need advice on leases ask come to lawyer. us because <laughs> ask, ask a lawyer, lawyer. <laughs> and then Message us <laughs> because we have a lot of experience with all different kinds of leases. Sarah. Nothing like a cute puppy getting comfortable in her window and a cute baby making funny noises and faces. What's n a little nerv nervous over here is I was just like, let's look at Southwest to see if we can book at least your flight. Maybe we'll book Grant's. Um, booking a one way ticket out of Florida. Out of Florida with no set time to return. Oh, that makes me so nervous. The only, we do have, we have an event that we're for sure coming back for. In the fall. In the fall of this year. And we have to come back for HHN. We have to come back for 4th of July. We have to come back. Well, the thing is, <laughs> HHN will probably fall within that fall wedding. Yeah. Um, we'll see. We'll see what, what happens. Are you nervous? But it's still, it's just like, wow, like, this is actually, A like, thing. bags are being packed. And I have it. And James is going to go on an airplane. And I'm not even going to be with you guys. I know. We're just going to have to go on an airplane again soon. Oh. Okay. 
Shall we do it? Stay with me, James. Yeah, let's book it. Okay, I need, clearly I need to shave. <laughs> it's, I've been working, I feel like I've been working during the day, taking a break to hang out with Sarah, James, and Eve, then working in the night, and then waking up and working again. And by taking a break, we've been like knocking out our to-do list. <laughs> yes. Things got even more real, because not only did we book Sarah's flight, we also, <laughs> we also booked Grant's flight. I and put it up because he's like in, in Chicago. Like, <laughs> up. So with that scan real. Now I'm about to look up U-Hauls. Oh my gosh. So not only did we book Sarah and James's flight, Grant's flight, we just reserved our... Sarah came in and talked me down to a 20-foot truck from a 26er that I wanted to get. A 20-foot truck with a tow for the... the Ford Fusion. Wow. I can't believe I'm not going to be in there with you and Evie. I know. It's going to be grand. I'm kind of nervous about it. It's going to be full of Chris shenanigans. <laughs> Christina said, I cannot tell you enough how much I am so happy I will not be in that car. <laughs> now you guys are going to have quite the time. We're going to get so many road snacks. So many monsters. Hi, right, so Sarah did January. <laughs> Well, like in February. All right, today is the 12th. I have been 29 years old for 30 days now. Ralph Waldo Emerson. Once you make a decision, the universe conspires to make it happen. Well, that couldn't be more fitting with us getting if airline tickets purchased and a U-Haul decided and reserved and our lease signed up and legitimate. It is weird how life sends us signals sometimes. P.S. I think I just hung these like five weeks ago, but they're probably going to come down very soon. Fun fact about the Brookharts, we got these pieces on our honeymoon in Route 66. Well, at least that one. Those two I'm not sure about, but that one, yes, that's actually a kitchen towel. It's been in every one of our kitchens since we've been married, since we came back from our honeymoon. This right here, first of all, what up, Reflection Peter, using a phone. This has only been up for literally like days, but guess what? Coming down, going to Chicago, can you hear Shit's Creek in the background? This hasn't been up super long, but we love it. Support your local artists. And this is my cute baby. There's his foot when he was being not cooperative. There's his face, he was angry about something there. My friend Lauren has an adorable baby. I didn't want to show the pictures on the fridge because I didn't ask Lauren if I can show her baby on the internet. But she's really adorable and I can't wait to meet her. And her and James are going to be, I believe, really good friends. I don't want to say they're going to be because what if they aren't? Because I don't want to set that expectation level for them. But they could be and it would be awesome if they were, but it's okay if they're not. Okay, I'm gonna show you the picture and then we're gonna ask Lauren tomorrow. Lucy is her name and cuteness is her game. Bom, 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 bom. Also, Lauren makes cards and she always makes the adorable ones and she made this Christmas card because it's like her husband, her baby, her. She loves Christmas, we love Christmas, we love each other and her cats. So one of the things I didn't explain the other day was that my company announced that they are purchasing Travel and Leisure Magazine. Um, so that's Wyndham Destinations, bought it for $100 million. So that's going to be finalized um, next month. But I have been doing, there's been a lot of work around that that I've been partly involved in, partly helping plan and stuff like that. So that's part of the reason why my work's been so extra crazy the past week. Your normal schedule is, is nuts. Is jam-packed and so... Just another fun project. This week feels a, feels a little bit less hectic than last week. Mm -hmm. But my tomorrow, my busy, I have another extremely busy day with meetings almost all day. So mm -hmm. hopefully after tomorrow, it lightens up for the rest of the week. I won't be able to get out and do some deep breaths in the fresh air. I was supposed to do more work tonight even that I just couldn't do. Did you say you went on a run tonight? No, I went on a three mile, 3.1 mile run. Awesome. Listen to Rambling Runner. Mm -hmm. um, it felt good. It was cool. It was cold. But I can't say that anymore because 50, 57 is 
beautiful weather when you mm. live in Chicago, but the cold, the air down here bites because of the moisture. But anyway, I'm going on. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.